With man, this is impossible, but with God, all things are possible. With this visa, you do not need any work experience, no degree, no IELTS, travel within three months. If you're applying from outside the UK, you will get your decision within three weeks. Does this sound too good to be true? Well, it is true. The only catch is it is a voluntary job in the UK. Hi everyone, welcome and welcome back to another video. If you're new here, my name is Grace and in my channel I share videos on how you can travel abroad to study, to work, to bring your family or to vacation. And in today's video, we are going to see how you can travel to the UK to work as a volunteer. And also, I'm going to be giving you three companies which are employing now. So please stay till the end. So now let's look at the government website for more details. Apply for a charity worker visa if you want to do unpaid voluntary work for a charity and you meet the other eligibility requirements. So this is information for people who are applying from the EU, Switzerland, Norway, Iceland or Liechtenstein. Number one, before you can apply to come to the UK, you must have a certificate of sponsorship from a licensed employer in the UK. The work you do in the UK must relate to the work of your sponsor organization. So how long does it take? You can apply for a visa up to three months before the day you are due to start your work in the UK. This date is listed on your certificate of sponsorship. Getting a decision. Once you've applied online, proved your identity and provided your documents, you will usually get a decision on your visa within three weeks if you're outside the UK, eight weeks if you're inside the UK. So how much does it cost? You, your partner or your children will each need to pay the application fee, pay for the health surcharge, which, which is usually £624 per year, prove you have enough personal savings. Application fee. For each person applying is £259. The fee is the same whether you're applying from inside or outside the UK. So how long can you stay? You can stay for up to 12 months or the time given on your certificate of sponsorship. So what can you do with this visa? You can study for some course you'll need an academic technology approval scheme certificate. You can work for your sponsor in the job described in your certificate. You can do a second job in the same sector as the same level of your main job for up to 20 hours per week. You can bring your partner and children with you if they are eligible. You cannot receive any payment for work. You cannot take a permanent job. You cannot get public funds. To be eligible, you will need to have a certificate of sponsorship reference number from your UK sponsor. Have enough money to support yourself in the UK. You'll usually need to have at least 1,270 pounds available. Be 18 or over when you apply. Money to support yourself. You must have at least 1,270 in your account to show you can support yourself in the UK. You will need to have had that money available for at least 28 days in a row. You must provide your certificate of sponsorship, a valid passport and other documents that show your identity, evidence that you have enough money, proof of your relationship with a partner or children. You must have a tuberculosis results if you come from one of those countries where you're required to have a TB test. You also need to have a blank page on your passport. You must apply online for this visa. You have to have your fingerprints and photograph taken at a visa application center. You must use UK immigration ID check app to scan your documents. Now to the companies who are employing volunteers at this point. The first one is Leah B London. And here is the application form which I tried to apply or fill in as much as possible. So they say before you start, please note, it is a genuine occupation requirement that you must be practicing Christianity with evidence of a growing Christian faith and involved in a local church. Leah B. London does not have suitable accommodation for married couple or families. You'll be expected to share a bedroom with other members. Leah B. London is a residential for Christian community, living, working, worshipping together and uh, so I, they would ask you are you a Christian? I said yes. Which country uh, issued your passport? I said the uh, rest of the world and have you been refused visa to come to the UK? So I said no. Have you previously traveled to the UK on tier 5 as a religious worker? I said no. Do you have enough money to apply for your visa? So I tried to say no I do not have enough money so that I see what happens and they say sorry we need that you should have enough money to afford to yourself, uh, for yourself or you can have the option of someone is paying for my 
uh, for my bills and stuff or yes i have enough money for my travel so do you have enough money to pay for your travel to the uk so again i said no i don't have so to see if they they probably could sponsor me or not or someone else is paying for you and if someone someone else is paying for you they have to you know write a sponsor's letter which they state that they will be responsible for whatever you know amount of money you will need so then you can upload it there's a jpeg or pdf so your future plans when you return uh you have also to you know put down what you plan to do after your visa expires mm -hmm. If you are selected, what is the earliest date you would be available to join? You put your date and the, le the last day you will be staying. How good is your spoken, not just written English? So you can say no if your English is poor or... But okay, they say you have to have good English. So yes, my spoken English is adequate or better. And then it shows you here the you know, community expectations that you believe in God. I understand that while I'm at Lee Abbey, I would not expect to live... I would be expected to live according to the values of love, faith, this discipleship. Also, I understand that Leah B holds a policy of responsible Christians living together. I will participate fully in the life and worship of the community and so many good things. So I guess you cannot apply if you are not a Christian. You know, you have to be a practicing Christian. So returning to your country, as you are coming from outside of the UK or Northern Ireland, please stick to show that you agree with the following statement. I understand that I must return to my home country when the time of community member at Liabi is finished. And again, they don't accept people, you know, who are married and if you have family. So I tried to say, you know, I'm married to see if they allow me and they don't accept. So you have to be single, divorced, widowed or other. I don't know what other stands for. And the same with marriage, they want people who do not have any children. So do you have any children? I said yes. So again, they say you cannot apply if you have children. So I will leave the link down below. Just have, you know, spend time to go and research for yourself, please. The second company employing volunteers in the UK is the Newton D. It says here a voluntary short-term co-worker application form so it says we accept applications for short-term volunteers co-working positions throughout the year our short-term co-worker co-workers come from all over the world for those who are outside the uk we can sponsor a tier 5 volunteer visa so so let us click on the application form to see what they require us to do so for volunteers wishing to apply to newton d please complete this application form in capital letters and send it to the email address up there. I will attach the links to these companies down below. So it's just general information, your, your date of birth, your names, next of king. Are you married? Are you single? How long are you planning to stay? Your dates and uh, simple things like that. Your education, your father education and uh, work experience if you have any part-time, full-time, voluntary jobs and a personal details if you have any medical history, mental, physical or anything like that. Your religion, can you drive your diet if you have any allergies and things like that. Guys, 2023 we want to help as many people as possible. So if you can share this video with people who would like to volunteer or travel you know, abroad to help their families and things like that, please like, comment and share with them and also ask them to share with their friends. So um, how did you find us about Newton D? There's from a friend, from internet, from a book. Or other and references you must have two referees you know um, so the link will be down below you can see what they require you to do it's either a teacher or an employer and these are the details they should be giving you or writing it down writing them down that's their telephone number their email address their profession and also do you have any criminal convictions have you ever lived or worked in Britain before if yes give details of your address and stuff like that so let us now move to the next company. And the third company for today is the Klana Bogan. I hope I'm pronouncing it correctly. And so you can, you know, click on their home about and they say that a volunteering, short term volunteering. Have you just finished school and would you like to, you know, take a gap year? Are you studying or are you looking to deepen your skills? Are you simply looking for a new adventure? 
you know, they are ready for you. And just click on each, you know, each part and read and how you can apply a day in the life of a co-worker and stuff like that. They just like, you know, interviewed the Carla and what her experience was working there. So let us see how we can apply uh, or fill in the application form. So apply to join your email, your name, your email address. You can click on if you're supporting for living or long-term volunteer, co-worker or a short-term volunteer. Like I always say, guys, it's always important to do your own research. I don't research as deep as I should. I'm just, you know, trying to find opportunities for you guys to come, you know, travel abroad. I come from Kenya. I know the struggle. So I'm here to help as many people as possible. And also, please make sure you click on each link like home life, work life, uh, all these links so that in case they, you know, they call you and they interview if you know anything about Klana Bogan and stuff like that, you need to do research, watch videos if they have, you know, be well informed of anything they do. All the requirements is all for your best. I'm going to say this will be what are they doing here? I'm going to say this. This is my first video of 2023. And I'm hoping that we can all grow together, you know, share information and see what year 2023 brings us. And if you've watched this video up to this point, I want to say a massive thank you for your support and to remind you, if you haven't subscribed, please just click on that button down there below and also the notification so that you get notified anytime you're uploading a new video. And until then, happy new year and God bless.